Hello, this is Jimmy and you are watching the Elementary Info YouTube channel. If you are looking for a herpes cure, visit the website link in this video's description and in the first comment. Hey everyone, today we're diving into a topic that, while commonly misunderstood, has significant implications both legally and ethically. Yes, we're talking about herpes, a prevalent sexually transmitted infection. Let's unpack the legal maze and ethical considerations surrounding herpes. First up, legal issues. Did you know many regions have specific laws about disclosing an STI to a partner? That's right. Disclosure laws require individuals diagnosed with herpes to inform their sexual partners, aiming to prevent the spread and protect public health. But how does this play out in real life and what are the consequences if someone fails to disclose? Next, there's the criminalization of transmission. In some places, knowingly transmitting herpes can lead to criminal charges. This raises big questions about personal responsibility and public health. Now let's talk privacy. Confidentiality in healthcare is crucial, yet those with herpes often face breaches of privacy, which can lead to serious personal and professional repercussions. This segues into workplace discrimination, where individuals can be unjustly treated due to their health status. On the ethical front, the duty to disclose to partners is a heavy one, weighed down further by the stigma and mental health challenges that come with a herpes diagnosis. This stigma can affect one's social, mental, and even physical well-being. Then there's the balancing act between public health interests and individual rights. How do we ensure the collective safety without impinging on personal freedoms? And let's not forget the ongoing research and vaccine development which poses its own set of ethical dilemmas. Lastly, healthcare providers have a critical role in navigating these waters. They must ensure informed consent, protect privacy, and also work to combat the stigma associated with herpes. In conclusion, navigating the legal and ethical landscape of herpes is about more than just managing a medical condition. It's about handling sensitive information with care, respecting privacy, and fostering a stigma-free environment. Thanks for tuning in. Let's continue to educate ourselves and others, creating a more informed and compassionate society. Stay curious, folks.